Testimony of Antonio, who saw famous people in hell, my name is Antonio Souza. I had a rapture experience in the month of November 2018, I will tell you my testimony, for when I was a new convert and weak in the faith, I was addicted to video games, even after accepting Jesus Christ in my life, one day I was playing Resident Evil game live, suddenly my spiritual eyes were opened and I saw a terrible monster from the game leaving the screen and entering in our dimension, when I saw this spiritual incident, I ran to my room for I was very scared, later I saw that this demon was chasing me, and on that day he afflicted and tormented me all night, until I put all my games off and never to play them again, when I renounced my addictions, another war arose in the house, my wife who was a believer began to make room for the devil, she was chasing me because I had no work at that time, I prayed to God and saw that her face transfigured onto the face of a demon, she was possessed and started cursing me with terrible profanity, I shouted the blood of Jesus and rebuked that demon, my wife became dizzy and I have to hold her so that she will not fall to the ground, I made her sit on the couch because she had been semi-conscious, and when that demon left, my wife returned to normality and came back to be that woman I wanted. She asked for forgiveness to me, at night I went to sleep and the Lord visited me and revealed great mystery to me, in fact he showed me millions of demons of divorce and family feud. He said that these demons cause divisions within households and place children against their parent, they cause wives to stand against their husbands, Jesus told me that one of these demons tried to cause division between me and my wife but the tie was cut through the invocation of the blood. These are demons that are working within homes and family on the earth and they make children rebel against their parents, Jesus told me that illicit things like internet and television is attracting demons into the homes, including games, altogether these things have changed the behavior of families and children, a visit to hell, after this experience, few days later, I was praying in the night, and when my eyes closed to sleep, they were immediately open in the spirit world and I was in a dark place that was extremely hot, and it was scary, this place was hell, and I saw horrendous and gruesome things, I saw many politicians and freemasons in hell, the first celebrities I saw in hell was the victory queen being burned in the flames of hell, then I saw the French king Napoleon Bonaparte, in a deep suffering, then I saw many kings and queens in hell, I saw entrepreneurs from all over the world that were agonizing, then I saw the Knight of Darkness, who is the principality of superhero movies and comic book, I saw demons who work and control Hollywood and the cinema industries. These category of demons affect humanity through the film industry, for motion picture industry is in their hands, then I saw the demon who work in animated cartoon and drawings and the many demons of other media, in the past when I was in the world. I really loved the comic book and superhero movies, my favorite superhero character was Batman, to my great surprise I saw my favorite superhero Batman who presented himself to me as the Knight and Cavalry of Darkness, this demon who is the Batman is known in the comic book as the Dark Knight, he has won many souls in hell, and most are souls conquered by this demon called the Dark Knight are fan of superhero movies and comic book. Batman is the principality behind comic book films and drawings of other superheroes, he is the one who commands other demons of hell to act and operate through the drawings, animated cartoon and movies, the Dark Knight known as Batman is the principality operating in comic book movie and is worshipped by many young people and children, I can guarantee that all these superheroes of Marvel and Justice League are demons. These demons and the night of darkness called Batman inspire directors, producers and filmmakers to bring demons of motion picture and films industry on the big screen, they inspire directors and producer to illustrate and portray them in animation and films, and many people think that the creators of superheroes are intelligent by their own imagination, in reality they are inspired by demons of hell in charge of film industry and motion pictures to create these films. The purpose of these demons illustrated in caricatures, animation and movies in the real world is to usher a golden age of superhero, and put in the consciousness of the mass the idea that these superheroes who are demons are the savior of the world, yet these are demons, 
This is a way of diverting the attention away from the real Savior Jesus Christ who is the Savior of the Word. I've always been a fan of Freddy Krueger films back in the past, but in hell I saw this terrible demon in flame, he is a soul ripper, who causes insomnia and nightmare in people's sleep leaving them disturbed, this demon is the same as in the movie and he has sharp claws that torture souls, many of these demons of hell are already famous in movies and drawings. I saw the demon Donald Duck who works inside the children's mind, this demon has the head and the foot of duck, and the child's body, I saw the poopoo that is a demon of child homosexuality, I saw the devil woodpecker that leaves the child violent and rebellious, I saw the demon tone that leaves the child troubled, I saw the great principality that is in charge of the drawings and animation, these demons work to destroy children's childhood. I saw the demons working in the area of games, and the principality gave order to his collaborator to inspire men to invent more games. In hell I saw a factory on the land that will produce lots of games, this is the reason why many children are going to hell, demons do great works in hell and on earth to destroy the children, I saw an army of demons coming out of hell and going up to earth to attack the church, I've seen thousands of demon fighting against the church. Then I saw my brother in hell. He had been murdered five years ago, it all started when my brother arranged a ritual and was sworn to death in Macumba. He was consulting Macumbera, and asked their priest to close his body and protect him against the stab of the knife and the bullet, and he paid this woman priestess of Macumba a huge amount of money. Few days after the ceremonies of Macumba, the Holy Spirit spoke through the mouth of a man who was a man of God. In fact this man had a vision of a spirit, who was like a hoodie man in black following my brother. The man in black in hoodie was the angel of death seeking to reap the soul of my brother, the man of God leaked the vision to me and he warned my brother about the danger he was running, yet my brother said that he was protected by Macumba protection and he had a closed body against bullet and stab. Many days after the warning of the man of God, my brother got his bike and was driving to work. Then a black car began to follow my brother, and a boy from the car fired several shots at the bike, my brother was hit and took six shots, he fell off the bike and died, he doubted the servant of God who warned him about the danger. He chose to believe in the prayers of Macumbera that did nothing to stop his death, when my brother saw me in hell, he raised his voice to ask me for help, he said, Manny, get me out of this place. I asked him, brother who killed you on that day. He replied, brother, I do not know, what I remember is that I felt a sting in the head, then I felt a shock in the skull, and a strong pain in the brain, then I fell off the bike, immediately my senses began to disappear, I lost my touch and all the senses of the body was gone, when I woke up I was already in this place surrounded by fire that began to feed on me. These flames of fire are devouring me. I cannot stand this fire anymore, I paid for my sins I just wanted to get out of this place for a second, and to be free from this place, help me, take me to mum, please, immediately a demon said, I am the one who was pushing you to cheat. Comma, you should never try to shield yourself from bullet and stab in order to avoid death, then I saw this ripper demon with his claws tearing apart the soul of my brother, seeing this I started to cry and suddenly a supernatural force pulled me from that place to the dark tunnel, I was now in another place, where I saw famous people, then this invisible force manifested and turned itself to a being of light and said, I am an angel of God, and I was there guiding you, for you were not alone in hell, though I was invisible, in this place I saw the television presenter Hebe, she screamed with pain and panic before demons, who tormented her souls in the flames of hell which have covered her. The wave of these fire seems like a tide of sea wave, she was just the grey skeleton, I saw the former president of Brazil Getulia Vargas, being tormented, the face of the president was filled with scared and terror in that place, I will not talk about torment of every famous person and their reaction, I'll summarize when talking about celebrities because there were many that I saw in this place. There in hell the demons did atrocities to these celebrities and quartered their bodies, the singers I saw in hell sang to the demons under torture and fire, I also saw music producer Miranda in hell, I saw the singer known as King of Bayou Luis, who
who besides being forced to sing had to play the instrument until her fingers fall. He played in those flames in hell and the demons said to them not to stop playing, actors selling their souls for fame, I saw two actors who die as a sacrifice to demon, I saw the actress Daniela Perez who was offered to the devil, and the actor Domingos Montana, who was offered to the Queen Lemanger of the sea, who took his soul to hell, through the waters of the ocean, this entity called Queen Lemanger, received the offering in the river of San Francisco, when the actor died. The Queen Lemanja received the soul of the actor and she pulled the legs of Domingos Montana down in the bottom of the river, I saw Daniela Perez and Domingos Montana in hell suffering, all the Hollywood celebrity and world-renowned actors when they die they come to this place, because of the clause of the pacts that they have signed to have money and fame, their souls belong to the demons of television, media and entertainment, satanic prison in hell. I kept walking in hell and saw several glass boxes, inside each box there was a puppet stuck, I was made to understand that each doll in these glass box is equal to one person in the earth, I saw a doll of Bishop Macedo stuck in the glass, and that of Valencio Santiago, and that of Duke Agena, the angel told me that they are in spiritual prisons for believing another gospel, while those dolls are inside these boxes they will not be saved. I asked the angel what would happen if one of these men repented. The angel said that the glass box will be broken and the dolls representing them will disappear, representing their freedoms, but as long as they are not free from sin they are in the spiritual prisons, and they are manipulated by the forces of darkness that deceive them. The angel told me that all the churches that have put aside the doctrine of holiness are in these glass box. I wanted to see the other glass boxes to know who are the people that were inside, but the angel did not allow it, and he led me to another place in hell, where I saw small coffins and inside each box was a plate with the name of a church. The angel said that the coffin represents the fact that its doctrines are dead and before God they are equal to a decaying corpse. I saw several coffins but the angel did not allow me to see inside. He said the church that imitate the doctrine of demons will be configured in hell. The angel took me in a place in hell very dark and illuminated only by reddish flames. The angel took me in several valleys where there were crowds of people, the size of each of these valley of hell seems like a whole neighborhood, there is a systematic classification of each sin in hell, there are various degrees of punishment according to the sin of every person there. There were torture room and several compartments filled with people suffering for every sin, people suffered a torture and reap fruits of punishment in hell Proverbs 22 verse 8 He who sows injustice will reap disaster, and the rod of his fury will be destroyed, what I perceived in hell is that, evil people suffered punishment depending on the degree of their evil deeds, the punishment of evil people is different from that of good people, though they are both extreme. If good people reject the gospel they will go to hell by their own, but by faith in Jesus is salvation which is a free gift from God granted to humanity, if you died with debt of your sin you will have to pay for your sins, many have refused the sacrifice of the absolution of Jesus that would remove all debts of their sin. The Principality of Mormonism, in a valley of hell a giant devil introduced himself to me as the Principality of Mormonism, and that place was full of people who were under his control. These were Mormons, all the followers of Mormonism come to this place when they die. The Principality of Theology. The angel took me to another valley, opposite to me was a giant demon who introduced himself to me as the Principality of Theology, this demon come up with several interpretations of the Bible to confuse Christians, he said, I am the one who is responsible of comments in different biblical texts and I produces Bibles studies with different ideas, I cause theologians to create a variety of current that will bring about tension, thus there will be one groups that defend a type of ideology and another groups that defend another theological stand, I create various theological ideology, in each of these current of doctrine there are truth, and different concept from one others, these are theological groups and current are opposed and have not agreement between themselves. Thus each group and current will defend their doctrine, we will make one doctrines opposite to another to put Christians in conflict among themselves, we will cause divisions between them, our technology will multiply ideologies and fabricate more teachings, 
I have millions of demons down there on the earth who work with me to produce more theological currents, we will manufacture more Bible adulterated with comments, and more teaching books to leave many spiritually ill of our teachings that are resulting in dead churches, how many divisions are we causing in the church, they discuss their theological views that are different, and this create these are theological differences, leaves us the church divided. The church will lose fire of fervency for accepting our technology, when the temperature of these churches fervency cool down, we will enter and work within these churches until we take control of the services that were led by the Holy Spirit previously, we will assume the direction, despite the departure of the Holy Spirit, we will make sure that people keep speaking in tongues and prophecy and have vision, these gift that were from the Spirit will be replaced by our equipment and our gift. Even though these people live in sin they will believe that it is God's Spirit working among them, for I will be the power of God among them, that principality revealed all his works and took me in his valley of Christians who were in torment in hell, for attaching themselves doctrines of men and demons, he said, they are here because they trusted in letters and theology, and they did not place their trust in the Holy Spirit, they trusted their knowledge but they gave no place to God. They preferred to believe in their knowledge rather than the revelation of the word inspired by Holy Spirit, our plan is working and we're going continue making books and Bibles teaching of different ways to cause chaos and confusion, we will design Bible school that question holiness doctrine, we will write evangelical books that will question the Bible itself and its inspiration, we will make more books of blessings and healing by indoctrinating our teachings, we will attach the church to materialism, they will not give up the things of this world they will, churches are dying spiritually in the very letter of the word of our theology, which is spiritually changing the spiritual structures of the church, we are changing the mind of the people of the church and they are falling in our trap, after the exposition of the wickedness of this principality, finally the angel brought me to earth to warn the church, that is treading on a minefield, we have to watch out, for fear of losing our salvation. These were the revelations that revealed that God bless the church that watch, may you stay in Jesus and that the blessings be bestowed from the Spirit of God upon you, Amen.